football is a great day for racing and a great day for pinball. Good morning and welcome from me, Jim Lindsay of JDL Pinball. Okay, so here we go. This is uh, Philly um, against uh, Stefan. Oh, and it's oh, very no, sorry. Yeah, with the scores have not been updated yet. So very far along. So he has all his moves finished except for the king on that one. Yep. And uh, Philly knows this machine inside out. He's, mm -hmm. he's had it at home, and we've got it in okay. the club. At, uh, people. So uh, he knows all the strategies here. So he needs one more shot to finish the mode, and I think that's right. Nice, and he got the Okay, Kobayashi so on go. Kobashi. Woo. And Philip is a very, very uh, relaxed player. He doesn't, mm -hmm. You notice how you know, the ball flies back at him, he just catches it. Yeah, absolutely great. Uh, nice to see uh, Kobashi multi ball. Uh, so um, awesome. Uh, Till Till isn't here this weekend, no. Uh... And yeah, of course we don't know how well he did in all his modes, so we won't know how much points we we'll get from we'll his shots here. But we will, yeah, we will find out. Kobayashi Maru is an interesting multiple in that uh, you can actually finish it, and if you do, uh, you can keep your two balls and just play on in. Uh, single ball play but with two balls oh, which no, is thanks. usually not allowed as per IFA rules but here it is because that's just how the software works interesting and he won't be doing that no so that was not a, a very profitable Kobashi but nice to see uh, always nice to see a, a mode being completed or mm. down to a wizard mode yeah and uh, this is his, uh, the third game, of course, Philip against Corolla. Uh, Philip chose this machine, and not surprisingly, chose Star Trek. Mm -hmm. So it's a machine he you knows extremely well. Uh, so, yeah, he's on his uh, level two modes now, which is slightly different than the level one. I think uh, the, the level twos are not timed, right? So. Uh, as in what you, you just need to hit the number of shots in yeah. the arcade. Yeah. And which also means you can't time them out them out, yeah. you actually have to play them and yeah. hit that number of shots. So one shot left for this mode. And it's interesting, he, he kept the Klingon battle for his last mode last time around, but now it's the first time he took one second tier. True, yeah. That's wonder why. I wonder if there is a logic to that yeah, or, yeah. or not. Nice for his next mode start. Yeah, he's doing some nice saves there. So he just seems to be struggling with the ball there, so he not seem to get control of the ball. <laughs> Yeah, that one. Ah, nice. Easier, okay. So, moves on to Prime Directive, uh, number two. Yeah. Okay. Okay, so uh, not showing any emotion, but actually not happy with himself there because he lost yeah. the ball. But actually really nice to see him on stream and uh, uh, obviously playing playing well. He's been playing well all weekend. He's had a, he's had mm -hmm. a good solid, uh, solid uh, time. Yeah, I mean, he must have played great to even get to where, yeah. he, is, where he was right now. To yeah. to my room, I think it's a pity we didn't see what he did before that. So, um, yes, you'll see him in Hurton at the Open Day. Uh, you'll see him, he's actually not going to be at the league meeting on uh, Wednesday. But here we are with Corolla. Corolla done extremely well to okay, uh, first lock to here. get through to round two of this tournament. Um, capable player. And a real regular here, of course, with uh, Klaus.
So yeah, he went for the for the left uh, diagonal that moves. her outlet ball side yeah uh, and she, yeah she's not going for the away team in order to light the spinner because that but yeah she, she needs too many points for that to make sense on the other hand it's it's a grind anyway right there, there isn't that one thing you can do to get no no you, you, you just have to keep grinding yeah, yeah. away don't you and hopefully you can uh, you can make the shots and Second you can look. score the points I mean, 150 million is is a good score on mm -hmm. uh, Star Trek, so you've got to have an exceptionally good game. But it's uh, it's not impossible. It's, uh, any, anyone can do it. Uh, yeah, she needs one more lock. Uh, no, now they're celebrating, but this. Yeah, still 20 seconds left, so going for the spinner would make sense. And um, yeah, she didn't use the upper flip there. That's nice. Yeah, I still, she still needs to light her third lock, but I don't see her actively going for it. Yeah, I would say take this lock first, and then... Oh, she already has a bit. I think that yeah, yeah. book is the third one, okay. Is that if that's the third yeah, one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She just needs to complete, so... And she was not far up there. All right. Nice. Nails it. All right. That was a good shot. And um, three in a row, so uh, a million per ramp. Oh, super pop bumpers. Uh, I asked her if she completed this uh, this row here. So yeah, yeah. 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 So super pop bumpers. What you want to do is uh, let the balls keep auto plunging, I suppose. Mm -hmm. Of course, now she's in multiple, but doesn't have a mode because she just finished the uh, yeah. sort of build. So is it worth going for? So if you're in multiple, would you actually just drain your balls in order to get more pops? Well, if, you, if you're on super pops and you've got ball save on, why not? Yeah. You know, yeah, yeah. Because the uh, super pops are uh, definitely valuable. Mm -hmm. If he has no balls left there. So, did we lose a ball? Uh, I think there's a ball stuck here. Yeah. Uh, that's, uh, we'll find it on the ball, the next ball search will mm -hmm. find it. Um, we, we, it's a regular uh, place for balls to stick on the Star Trek. Mm -hmm. uh, but um, so unless she is in multi ball, oh, there we go. So. Uh, Yeah, no, she's out of multiple, but now I'm wondering whether she played multiple during the ball game. Yeah, I'm sure I'm sure that's the case. But I think that she she lost two balls pretty quickly together, so I, I don't think it really affected the game yeah. that much. I don't think she could have known that there was a ball stuck either. So the dimensions scoring that she has ready on the bench, and that's the that's not a multiball, right? That's just a. It's just a score, score. and yeah. it's normally one that you want to try and avoid. Mm. Um, because you have it, to hit the vengeance for, yeah. for points, right? And it, and it's a dangerous shot, and it doesn't mm. really give you anything in reward. Yeah. Uh, yeah but she takes, she it. takes it anyway. Um, but she took it with a lock, which is probably mm -hmm. worthwhile. So, vengeance mode. Now you have to shoot back into the vengeance. Um, you have to shoot it enough times to uh, kill it. Five times apparently. And, uh, uh, and they say it only gives you points, it doesn't give mm -hmm. you a multi ball. Oh. So unfortunate. That was a great effort by Corolla. Uh, attempted to come back there, she managed to pull all the way back to, let's see. 50, yeah, that's, 59 that's million. Not a bad score, actually. 59 is a good, good tournament score. Mm -hmm. so, 
Um, okay, uh, so let's come back to uh, the standings again for a while. And let's see where we are here. Uh, so that will be Philip Kroll going through to the quarterfinals. So uh, he will move to J1, he will move to here. Mm -hmm. um, with uh, Hugo Ritter, 2-1 uh, up against Carsten. Preacher. Preacher, okay. So uh, back to rig number three. Thank you. Okay, this is uh, Peter Schmidt versus Mark van der Buchten. Oh, so they are in the quarterfinals already? Or? Um, Does it seem to be 0 0 now? Peter Schmidt. Oh, sorry, they just yeah, started the, there. The yeah, yeah, okay. So this is a round two game? Um, yeah, he already had a good game. One more so. 84 million. And Mark seems to be at 5 million and still has one ball left to play. So uh, using the top lanes there to get another bonus uh, multiplier and uh, playing a very very good uh, center shot towards move your car. So can bonus actually be significant on this game? Um, it's more I think that when, once, you've, uh, once you've got the times 10 Mm -hmm. And every completion gives you five million points. Yeah, yeah, I see. So the you know the, it's not a huge bonus yeah. machine, but um, uh, if you can manage to get it's either times ten or times five, I'm appealing it's times ten. But, mm -hmm. uh, okay, so he's trying to uh, take his move your car shots on the fly. Uh, yeah, Let's and his his uh, second move your car is just starting. Mm -hmm. So he's already on eight times bonus. You see, so. Okay, playground award. Maybe. Oh, he's on the middle. So maybe he wants to do that instead of his last move with Tarfoot. Oh, that was a, an interesting pass from left to right. It was, yeah. Whether that was actually deliberate, I'm <laughs> yeah, not yeah, sure. Yeah. It looked very impressive if it was, <laughs> yeah. Peter. That's, uh, it that's looks a... like something Arvid would do. Yeah, true. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, maybe this is Arvid. Maybe yeah, yeah. You, know, <laughs> you can't tell because of the hat. <laughs> Yeah, so, it's going uh, with millions, but nice. Yeah, doing uh, for hurry up, and the ball is gone. Okay, out we go. Uh, what have you finished on? It must be a 200 million, right? He lost 20, oh, 50, 252. Nice. Well played. That's a great score, Peter. Uh, and this is Mark. Uh, Mark van der Gupten is another great um, fan of JDL Pinball. Uh, he. Uh, he, I think he was one of the first people to bring uh, a bottle of wine as a, yeah, really as a very nice, nice presentation yeah. bottle uh, of, um, of wine that he gave to us and, and a really, really touching little speech saying how much he appreciated what we did. Oh, cool. uh, and uh, yeah, real, real gentleman. So, uh, I mean, I say he was the first, now everybody does it? Um, we, we, we have a little collection, I mean we've got a little <laughs> Madden's cave of things uh, that people have given us. I know you've not given us anything yet, but I'm sure there's going to be, you know, maybe a pinball video uh, yeah. towel or something. Yeah. Look, you're doing me a predictor. The, the, predi oh, yeah, the yeah, predictor yeah. is itself a... Uh... <laughs> yeah, that was a short one for you. Okay, so Peter takes game one of that. Who mm -hmm. has the next game? I'm staying with um, Mark, oh, yeah, but, Mark and the Peter team. group, right. so this makes this makes sense. Mm -hmm. So we will be following this group through to mm -hmm. completion. Uh, obviously, uh, Peter took the first game, so that will get updated any second. So this is Mark's choice. Yeah. Oh yeah, it is. Um, and you know, I wouldn't have picked this as one of Mark's favorite machines if you'd have asked mm -hmm. me. But yeah, I don't know actually what types of games he likes to play. Well, he's, he's very much control player. Yeah. Doctor Who is not really a control game. It's uh, it, yeah, it's, you're putting everything yeah. on the fly as well. Yeah. yeah. So um, I, I wouldn't have expected this to be mm. one that suited his uh, style of play. And he can play. Don't get me wrong. Mm. I've seen him play it extremely well. So he chooses yeah. Doctor Six. Of course. Uh, and uh, then goes for the video escape mode, that's fine. 
Yeah, I know, yeah. It just bounced in there. Yeah. So, okay, this is more like it. So, uh, here we go. go. Loop. <laughs> loop. Loop. So, uh, let's see how many he gets to. Well, no more than 10. Because then it would go down for a semi I do. I wonder with this machine, you know, whether to take this uh, diverter away. Mm, yeah, that would be interesting. Ah, okay, he's a, he's a letting it bounce back. Yep, he's a, a, a Colin McAlpine guy. Ooh, that was a nasty That's there. Off. I'm going to show you a replay of that because I believe every software developer for pinball machines should make this impossible to have. Mm -hmm. yeah. and because the software can detect it going up and back down, so why don't we? I mean, you probably can't do it in multiple, but in single play, uh, yep. why, why not compensate you for, for that sort of thing? Because you're actually playing exactly the right shot to control the ball, so mm. why, why do you get punished? Anyway, at one point I'm talking about making the games faster, <laughs> and then, <laughs> yeah. then introducing yeah, something right. that's going to make them longer, so yeah. <laughs> don't have it both ways. So this is Peter. Um, Again, loop strategy. And once you get to 10 loops, you get to something called a sonic boom. Yeah, let's see what he does with it. If he takes an on the fly W shot, yeah, he does. But he misses it. And now uh, well, a bit more controls. Okay, and the, the half, half ramp and down mm -hmm. the side out lane, that's uh, Paul Englert's Dr. 12. Yeah, but it was interesting because he, he tried for the W the first time. Yeah, yeah, and then, and then he, the he another shot at the W, but he didn't take it. He tried to yeah. bounce it over, but didn't go for the O either. And that's that's probably an example of not changing your strategy mm -hmm. uh, for halfway through a ball. So. Uh, 60 million to 18, really nothing much in these scores so far. So, uh, no, Dan, the, uh, the score here is correct. So it's 1-0 uh, to Peter. And, um, and yeah, who can choose the games? I think the higher seat starts choosing a game and then they alternate. Then it alternates, yeah. yeah. That's correct. That's dangerous. And he's gone. Mm -hmm. So uh, 85 million, again, it's uh, not a score that is insurmountable by any means. The, uh, yeah, we, we've only seen two Sonic Booms and only one actual Sonic Boom collection. Yep. Uh, okay, Dan, I'll check, I'll check the spreadsheet afterwards. Um, Dina, Dina will be reading the track of the chat, so she will pick, uh, she will pick that up. Okay, 19. Next one for Sonic Boom. Here we go. Here we go. Let's see what he does this time. Uh, yeah. Okay, he executes it. the W, and then the H, and then the O. Very, very nice. Uh, perfect Sonic Boom. And now just with that, uh, more times. Back into ramps, yeah. And uh, we've seen this a few times with uh, 100 plus ramps in a uh, tournament game. Um, arguably, people say this is boring. I actually don't think it is uh, because you sort of feel, but you know, you know, when you when you're playing this shot, you sort of uh, you're sort of willing it to go in there. Yeah, yeah. And, uh, and I mean it's sort of interesting because at least you have a, a collect at the end. You can mess up. And exactly, it's interesting. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so it breaks, it, it breaks it up, it's yeah, not yeah. just uh, it's not top just the, the one thing. Yeah. On the other hand, you could argue in the new Ghostbusters code you're doing the same thing and I think not, not really anybody likes it, so maybe because that's a classic and it's always been like that. Maybe, sure. yeah. There he is, back to loops again. Now, the, uh, the oh, thing with playing that shot is you go into the who 
mode. Mm -hmm. So the WHO then becomes a shot, but it doesn't count towards the sonic boom loop. Yeah, so it goes down again. And it can do I mean, it can be points too. But. It can be. It can be a lot of good points. So it's uh, okay. So. But Peter's, Peter's uh, decided to just have a whale around the, mm -hmm. around the play field at the minute. Mm -hmm. Let's just hit, hit some balls somewhere. Uh, so he's going to be close to multi-ball at the uh, next thing. Okay, that's better. Back in, oh, sorry, back in control, but he actually didn't quite make it. Oh, and he tells oh, them uh, okay. that is... Uh, we did have to loosen the tilt on this machine quite mm. considerably because uh, people used to tilt just doing the loops yeah, with the yeah, en yeah. energy that you put into the loop shot. Mm. So the tilt at Bob has been considerably uh, relaxed, mm. but um, that was still a little bit too much. So um, yeah, but great score, 255 million. He's definitely put a target up for Mark. Mm -hmm. and. Uh, yeah, let's um, let's have a quick look at those stomachs then. So, the uh, game we're following here, where they gone? Peter Schmidt. Okay, he's, he's two one. So you correct them oh, yeah. if the uh, the spreadsheet is more likely to be correct than um, uh, than the scores here. The scores here are on a, from a different spreadsheet. Dina um, mm. will uh, no doubt pick those up. We can change them here if you like. So that's a two, and that's a one. So, if Peter wins this, obviously that's the end of. Yeah, and it's it's interesting. Uh, he tilted, so Mark waits, of course. Oh, sorry, that's the wrong way around. It's Mark that's two. Uh, Mark waited for for the tilt pot to settle down, but that meant that his multiplier counted down, so it's one X now. Yeah. So, is that the right thing to do? Yeah, I mean, waiting for the tilt pot is yeah, of course, it's the right yeah. thing to do, but it's. It's a bummer because he had his It really player is, going, and, yeah. it, and it becomes a yeah. It's a disadvantage created by the the other player, isn't yeah. it? So, uh, which is interesting because, I mean, the other player could, could tilt on it. purpose. Yeah, they are not allowed, yeah. of course, but no, they but, could do it. But they could make it look like it wasn't on yeah. purpose. Uh, so, this is Mark now on Sonic Boom. So, but yeah, the, the thing is, once you get to a Sonic Boom, you uh, at full multiplayer anyway, so it doesn't yeah, really matter. Right. So Mark looking uh, pretty focused here. But Peter still has one ball to play. So. Oh, has he? I thought uh, Mark was going to, but maybe not. No, the spread, the spread. Oh, he's that would be right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. So I would actually wait, time out the who mode here. Yeah. That was a very, very late flip and he could lose that. Okay. That again was a bit dangerous, that could have easily rolled into the uh, outlay. When he's got away with this again. You gonna get away with this one? Yeah, looks like it. Right, the uh, pinball gods are on Mark's side at the moment. Yeah, it's getting a lot of chances here. We don't normally no, get... Uh, that was okay. it. And uh, just fall short of the 255 million points needed. So that will uh, take it to a, uh, a tie-break game. Um, nice. Okay, so what are we doing? Okay, so uh, we're staying with uh, Peter. Oh, right. So this is the uh, deciding game. So this is uh, Getaway High Speed 2, Peter getting a power drain, so only managing 15 million. This machine is Peter's choice, mm -hmm. so Peter plays first. And uh, of course everybody knows how to play Getaway High Speed 2. Um, okay, so uh, this score is actually incorrect, this should be 2 here or so. And it looked like uh, Peter was going for the red line because he was already on his uh, third gear when he joined. Oh, and he does the uh, brain thing to yep. collect gears. But, but only one. Only one. Yeah, yeah I gotta say, it's, it's sort of really embarrassing when it uh, 
Well, it's really disappointing when it uh, the ball save doesn't come back. Yeah, and, and of course we don't know whether there's a ball in the lock already because that changes the timing. That's of the right. Yeah, yeah. Ball save. But I can't see. It. I can't see a ball here. So. Oh yeah, you would see it there. Yeah. Yeah. So build up the revs until you get to red line. Change of gears. Yeah, that is really nice. Fourth gear already. So already on fourth gear. Fourth gear lights uh, video mode. Some great reaction play here from Mark. You would say he's a control player. I don't really believe it with the way he's shooting here. I know. This, this, this is this is not the mark. I think this is a. a oh, it's, guy. it's the, the other one again. I think it's, it's probably his glasses. I think this yeah, is a yeah, new yeah. disguise. Maybe yeah. this is sort of like Superman disguise, uh, <laughs> yeah. you know, Clark Kent style, that sort of thing. Um, he's got a lot lit, which he will try and play. I think. Okay, supercharger. Yeah. It's Supercharger super mode. On the other hand, some people even time it out because it doesn't give you progress. It just gives you points. Give you points. But you get 80 million points yeah. from Supercharger, so it's, it gives you a lot of points. It's not... Uh... Yeah, it's definitely not an easy time out. It's a difficult, deci difficult decision, but some people... Video mode. Is he going to drive on the left or the right? Yeah, he's going he's to got, drive he's on, on the left. The madman. Yeah. No. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, do you? And I think uh, I think I actually said something going a few years ago with this when I started talking about left hand and right hand mm -hmm. driving, and a lot of the Europeans now deliberately drive on uh, the yeah. right side. <laughs> and, and, and there was sort of there was a, a sort of rumor that it was because there was a extra ball or, or uh, you scored more okay. points or yeah. something. Right. Not not true at all. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Red Mania lit already. Nice. On his ring, but that's going to be ready for him next ball. So well played. Um, Mark, uh, but it's not Mark, it's the guy who was yeah, pretending the, the to be Mark, Mark yeah. the, other, the other Mark. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah, he could have used the kick bet now that he would have gotten had he started with the media. Yeah, and we'll put the two back in there because I lost it again. Oh no. Mm. Oh wow, is that end of, is that end of game? No, it was just ball two. Okay, that's ball two, okay. All right, so red line mania. So the first thing you do is shoot the ball into the supercharger mm -hmm. and uh, uh, light the first jackpot, which is only 10 spins around the supercharger. Oh. And then you hit the jackpot either around there or around there. Mm -hmm. And then you hit the supercharger again for 20 spins. Yeah, I think so. And, and yeah, you will add the super and jackpot. Super jackpot. Doing that. But the thing is, I mean, right now there are no locks in the game. If there is a lock in there, I think in this version of software, um, after you get the jackpot, you can't immediately light the super jackpot because it will restart your multiple. Then you have to do the jackpot again and then you get the super jackpot. Okay, yeah. yeah, yeah, interesting. Do you want to be it? Uh, I still have, a have another one anyway because it's you know. Can we can we have two? Can we have two? Beers? Make make Arnold's a small one, <laughs> a cheap one. I mean, I mean, I don't matter about big it is. Let's yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a cheap one. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he really wants to red line in your shot. Yeah, no point at all in shooting with no. that top flipper. Just let it go. <laughs> yeah. But I mean, if you've uh, been shooting with the upper flipper the whole game, you don't even know how the feet comes down. When no, you no, don't, that's right. Yeah, yeah, it's, 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 it's like a safety thing, too. You've got a bad sort of feel about this, haven't you? It's like, uh, <laughs> no, come on. It's, um... uh, Yay! There we go. Woo! Well done. And this is actually the best way to relight your pick back. If anybody asks you how do you relight the kickback and get start, away... Start red line. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, absolutely. So, uh, I was actually wrong. I think the jackpot is lit straight away on red. Oh, yeah, that's right. I remember. Yeah, uh, jackpot uh, did right uh, away. Uh, but super, you have to go 10 times around the supercharger. So, he's uh, sensibly controlling the balls here. So, he's lost his, um, his outlane save here. Mm -hmm. uh, his kickback. 
so he's got to be careful oh, no. and that's uh, that's yeah. gone so that's um it's totally consultate the jackpot there's there a bit a, of a grace period right? yeah yeah there is a grace seconds. period that was a very nice attempt at tap pass though Did you see that okay and that gives him 25 million for the jackpot but i say if it had then managed to spin the turbocharger uh, it would have had super jackpot for I think it's 50 million actually. I was going to say no, 100 right, the, million. The thing, the thing about Red Eye Mania is, uh, the, and the reason why you want to play Red Eye Mania before you're not on multiple, uh, is that it maxes your super jackpot. So it would have been 100. Ah, okay, it would have been 100. Okay. And if you play the, and it, it stays at that level, so if you play a normal multiple after that, it's still at 100 million. Ah, okay. Whereas if you play a normal multiple first, you start at 50 million. How can there be things on machines that we don't? Oh, know? that was a fun one. That was definitely a fun one. So yeah, it's it's weird because uh, it's sort of sort of deep rules, but a lot of the deepness of the rules come from just software bugs. Yeah, good point. So 168 million points. Uh, Peter fighting for his life here he is. Uh, it's actually this is two, two this score. So uh, yeah, we and this takes a warning. He's got to be really careful here. Yeah, but that, that was interesting. It said Warnung in German, right? Yes, they did, yeah. But didn't it say Achtung before? Well, that was, yeah, warning and... Oh, okay, yeah. yeah. Because they, those, yeah. they two different words for the same thing, but why, why does one... Why does one... Yeah, well, never mind. He's driving on the European side, yeah. of, the road, of course. So uh, yeah, that's a good, that's solid, like a solid <laughs> German. He's not, he's not, he's not going in with any this, uh, you know, UK crap. It's, uh, you know, <laughs> let's stick to the right side of the road. Okay, so uh, lock is that the one. So if it's, if it gets to multiple, mm -hmm. he actually sounds a good chance of catching up here. Yeah. So, uh, supercharger. Um, the reason for taking supercharger is actually to then use the supercharger next time to light the locks. Yeah, I mean every every ramp shot spots you one of the the lights you need for lighting your locks. Okay, lock two. And they could uh, uh, jiggle yeah, the gear lever there and start yeah. secret mania, but I'm not really sure he's not going to do that. And the things you don't actually want to check it, you want to do want to because if you do more than that, uh, then the game forgets your lock status. It forgets all your traffic lights you've done before, which is another oh, bug. Oh, and he's gone. That's really, really sad. Oh, Peter, you played so well in that round. Uh, that's a shame to lose yeah, Peter at that, that was stage. A good effort. Uh, but really, really well played to uh, to both players.